the Indiana Basketball uh, Association changed their ruling, so then we made it a little different. We had uh, celebrity tournaments. We had uh, old people from the TV and radio and so on and so forth would play the girls that graduated prior. And that was an exciting game, uh, but uh, when they changed the rules, that ended that, and we had to go with the Indiana, Ohio All-Stars. And it was only girls to begin with until they talked us into having the boys as well because it looked like the girls were getting scholarships and the boys weren't. So we decided to make it uh, for the benefit of the, the players. And it was a little bittersweet, but uh, we stayed with it and it's just kept growing and growing and growing. And we were just thankful when we had a, a firm like uh, McDonald's come in, and help us out, it makes a big difference. Their notoriety and so on. So it, it's just it's been very good since they stepped in too. And we have a lot of other good sponsors as well. Now, do you guys have the roster set or do you still need to have tryouts? We're going to have tryouts. We always have tryouts because uh, uh, what happens, see, we invite the coaches there pr uh, prior for the tryouts as well. And they give scholarships before the, the, uh, they're chosen. So if they're chosen, then that's fine. But if they're not and they still have the scholarship, we feel we benefit from it. So really these games are for, for those kids who, yes. who don't have scholarships yet and they're trying to get their, get themselves out there. That's right. Most of your, your D1s, we, we, you know, they already have scholarships. A few of them don't, but uh, most of them do. And, but uh, the NAIA is probably the area that we work with most because they have the, the um, most players here that can play in the NAIA. When you buy a ticket, you'll have an opportunity to buy a chance at the three-point contest. And we will select five people, five, in, five from the uh, girls' game, five from the boys. And those, those folks will participate. So it could be an interesting three-point. One might win it. Well, exactly. <laughs> I mean, we, we definitely want to see someone walk away with those $50 arch cards. Okay. Yes. Uh, Absolutely. Is there a dunk contest or anything? Oh this yes, year? we have the uh, we have the three point contest. We also have the dunk contest, and that's very exciting for the fans. They really uh, they enjoy those too, and I think the three the three point shot with McDonald's uh, fifty dollar arch, arch card will that'll be exciting too. Because winter tryouts. Tryouts. You know, Get, off the top no, of your head, you can, <laughs> you can it's, look. It's one week. Next, Next Tuesday, Next Tuesday, next Tuesday, next Tuesday. Yeah. Next Tuesday, next Tuesday. Next Tuesday. Thursday, Boys are at five. five and the girls are at seven. Okay. And then Thursday, we'll have another tryout. They have to attend at least one tryout. If they think they did well enough on that one, they wouldn't have to be two. But uh, I think they want to assure themselves a spot. Okay. Anything else then, you want to then add? Then practice the next week. Then we'll have. Uh, uh, We'll have it cut down to 12 players for the boys and 12 for the girls. And then we'll probably have coaches in at that as well.